great news to start the weekend. You've extended your loan spell here. You're here till the end of the season. Yeah, yeah. It's, um, I'm just glad it's all kind of sorted now and everything. And uh, I always had a feeling that I'd probably stay, especially playing games and everything. That's what I came over here for, to get games, get that experience. And I think it's really helped me as a player being over here. I've got, I feel like I've got better and better the more games I've played. So I feel like it was only right to stay to the end of the season and try and help the team go as far as we can go, yeah. Speaking to you over the last couple of weeks, I think you, you wanted to stay as well. You've, you've really enjoyed it here. Yeah, I have. Yeah, I've really enjoyed everything about it. Just even just outside of football, you know, the house that I'm living in and then all the lads here are uh, great and everything. And then, yeah, I've been really enjoying the football and that. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we can just keep keep doing what we're doing at the moment. And it's always good when you're winning games and stuff like that. And uh, so, yeah, hopefully we can just keep going and then see where we get to. I'm sure it was a big move for you at the, the start of the year. First time, I presume, away from home, different country. You've 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 seen have grown up an awful lot of you know what I mean. Yeah, definitely. I've had a few people tell me like, including my granddad and stuff, turn from a boy to a man. So yeah. I think that's something that I was trying to look for when I definitely came over. So obviously, it's a big uh, move for me, a big different experience, something that I never had before. So uh, yeah, I'm glad it's kind of helped me with that, and can only try and make that better, and then be as best as I can be when I end up leaving in November, yeah. As a, from, a, from a mental point of view, I'm sure you're delighted it's sorted. It's probably, it's probably been in your mind for the last couple of weeks, wondering whether you're going to stay or go back, but now, you've, now you, you can just concentrate on the rest of the season. Yeah, exactly. Uh, like you say, the last few weeks I wasn't quite sure whether I was staying or going. A lot of people asked me and stuff like that, and I couldn't give them an answer. Um, but uh, yeah, the last week or so, I, I kind of knew that it was definitely getting sorted. And it's, it's good because now I can just focus on just being here and just uh, taking each game as it comes now and just focusing on that, yeah. You say the main thing when you come over you wanted to play, you've played in every game, which you, you, you can't do any more than that. You must be happy with that. Yeah, exactly. I can't ask for much more. I can't, you know, I can't say the gaffer's not giving me an opportunity because he's given me an opportunity in every game. So, yeah, that's the one main aim that I wanted just to get senior f football into my, into, my, into my games and stuff like that. And obviously I've got that and I think I... It's helped me a lot, and uh, yeah, I can only get better with more games. I think, yeah. I, I, have we seen that? We think back to the, the goal line clearance against Finn Harps earlier in the season, but I think in in recent times people sort of know you more from going forward, and you think of those those assists you provided over the the last couple of weeks. You know, is that a sign of your confidence growing? Yeah, definitely. Obviously, I came over here not having played too much at right back. Mm. Obviously, back at Stoke, I was playing more mainly a centre half, so. Something that I really wanted to work on from the start was my attacking play and getting forward more. And I feel like probably the first few weeks I wasn't as confident and I probably didn't get as uh, forward as much as I wanted. But I feel like it's, it's shown the last few weeks, like you say, that uh, I started to believe in myself and get myself forward more. And yeah, just trying to get more more assists like that and put more crosses in. Yeah, it's hopefully. becoming a bit of a trademark now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, <laughs> yeah I think it's a good little position for me, that little deep, deep cross. I feel like that's where. I put my best crosses in, but yeah, hopefully I can get some more and some more from different angles and maybe a goal or two as well would be nice. That'd be nice, that'd be yeah. nice. One of those assists, Lewis, that came against UCD here earlier in the season. We have them we have them tomorrow night. Yep. It's it's gonna be a difficult game. There's no there's no easy games as you've seen in this league. Yeah, yeah, like I said, like we always say, it's there's no easy games and obviously we went there a few weeks ago and uh, we drew two two to them, so we know it'll be a tough game and we know that we'll have to work hard and Make sure we take our opportunities and make sure, like like we have been doing uh, so far, keep us keep ourselves tight in the back and stuff like that, and try and get another clean sheet. And hopefully, we can just get the goals and then get a, get a victory. Hopefully, we're going for eight eight wins in a row at Ori. You must you must enjoy playing out there when it's when it's like it was against Rovers there in particular last week. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it's 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 great playing out there. I, I love it. And, Obviously, one thing that I was, when I first came over, I wasn't sure how the surface was going to be, but you get used to it, especially playing there every week, and then you can't kind of enjoy it, to be fair. And then, obviously, the, the atmosphere and the crowd, it, you buzz off it, and that's why I feel like we've turned Oriol back into a, more of a fortress these days where, uh, you know, obviously we're winning, and hopefully we can keep that going, especially tomorrow night, yeah. yeah. Just finally, you mentioned your granddad, Lou. He was in he was in Talca Park last week with your mum, yeah. To yeah. watch the game, you must be delighted to see him coming over for a game. Yeah, yeah, he's all he's been saying to me for the last few weeks that he's wanted to try and get over, and then he managed to come over because I think it was easy for him to get to a Dublin game. So, 
Um, yeah, he came over and he jo enjoyed it. To be fair, he's, he's, he he doesn't say much to me about like my performance and that, but he spoke to me about the game and that, and thought that we probably could have won and stuff like that. So yeah, well, I think he enjoyed it. So uh, yeah, it was nice. Yeah. We might get to see him at Orion now before the before the end of the season. Yeah, I'd, I'd think so. I think he'd want to come up here definitely. So yeah, we'll, we'll see. Yeah. Good stuff, Lewis. It's brilliant to have you here for the, the remainder of the season. Thank you very much. Thank you.